The way we implement change, the way we implement change in America is through elections. We change governments here at home in an orderly and formal way. And in that orderly and formal way, and lawful way, we need to overthrow the government of the United States under Donald Trump. <laughs> There is, please, thank you. There is, there is a small cadre of people currently in power who are hell bent on continuing a malicious immigration policy that has set this country up for charges of human rights violations by the global community. This cadre has looted money from the federal treasury and deposited it directly into the bank accounts of their most ardent political supporters so that they and several generations of their descendants will have the resources to maintain the GOP in political power for as long as possible. They view and treat women as human beings that are not entitled to the same constitutional protections that men are. They are sons. They, are, they themselves are sons, husbands, fathers. And yet when the time arrived in the thick of the Me Too movement to set politics aside and establish that women's rights were more important than political expediency, they failed. And it was ugly 